previously on Oxventure. Having defeated the first wave of Vacatus's enchanted cauldrons, the Oxventurers reunited with Dob, who had gone somewhat overboard in his attempts to capture the thief queen Katie Pearlhead by becoming engaged to her. There was no time for celebration, however, because Vacatus appeared once again, sparking an epic brawl that ended with him learning of the Oxventurer's other nemesis Liliana and vanishing, presumably to try and steal her magic the same way he stole Prudence's. Will he succeed? Will he fail? And which of those two options would be worse? We see what Dob does with the hair. <laughs> does he throw it away? Yeah, or no, does he it has sentimental it? value. <laughs> so, Dob, I suppose you won't be needing that hair anymore, I say. Yeah. Uh, I feel like it might still have some use. What if we need to like magically find Liliana at short notice? Yeah. More importantly, did v did Vicator steal my magic? Um, I cast Moonbeam on a nearby tree. On a nearby Coruscant. <laughs> <laughs> Do something way less destructive. <laughs> Do you not have no, any done it. I'm going to try and spells. cast Moonbeam. No. Johnny, does it happen or not? Yes, a nearby tree explodes. <laughs> ah! Oh, that's a relief. <laughs> okay. Right, I can see that when I uh, take a break, things really fall apart around here and that I am, in fact, the glue that holds uh, uh, the guild together. So, let's, so let's just recap. Uh, what did I miss? Um, inside the orb was a, a sort of puckish... Loki type mischief wine trickster. sprite. Yeah, chicken mm -hmm. leg trickster god. Vacatus with the chicken legs. Yeah. Vacatus Legally with the good distinct from Loki, you know, because you don't want to get sued by Disney. <laughs> I mean, chicken legs makes you pretty legally distinct. Okay. Um, uh, and and he, 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 he started in motion a, a, a magical thing that will see the whole world consumed with fatal revelry. Yeah. Uh, the party and, city was going to expand outwards until party it planet. covered its party mm. planet. Party became planet. A party planet. And he says he can't stop what he started, and then he was like, "But hold on, with if if I if I had the magic of a powerful mage, I could do it." And we told him about Liliana, and then he vanished. He's gone to uh, get Liliana's magic so he can use it to speed up the pacification well, we have to, process. We have to warn Liliana. No, but we also want her to not have. Well, magic anymore. We, we, it's, com it's complicated, isn't it, though, Corazon? So, where are we headed then? <laughs> well, you... maybe for you, Dom. <laughs> <laughs> Things you say. Her head crosses her arms. <laughs> Hang on! No, no, she left. She left. I'm only having this conversation. She's, 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 in, she's, she's <laughs> waiting for the drinks. They're taking okay. such a long time. Right. So, what's the plan? Okay. So, has the expanding party city stopped expanding at this point? Uh, do we ha currently have a lid on it? Pretty much. Um, around these parts, you've destroyed pretty much all of the cauldrons. The angry mob that you calmed down at the start of the last um, episode is still just sort of quaffing wine from the cauldron nearby. Mm -hmm. uh, they seem quite content to do that. It's likely they will eventually get tanked up enough that they're going to start building more flat pack, furni flat pack furniture. But if what Vacatus is saying is true, then their impact would be like throwing a pint of water into the entire sea mm. versus okay. everyone else. Yeah. Mm. Okay. All right, well, Vacatus is off to get Liliana's magic. We don't want that to happen, but also we don't want Liliana to have her magic either. Uh, I guess we, sh we need to go there where they are. And then okay. do what? And then the solution will present itself. <laughs> and then we, you know, get, get all up in the situation, Prudence. Well, wine is a kind of solution. <laughs> yeah, yeah, an alcoholic solution. We could... We could Kill no, I mean, two literally. Birds with Who's the solution? most magical person we know? <laughs> I'm thinking Me. that bloody wizard bin bag. What if we brought him in? No, Third party. no, 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 it's a one-on-one-on-one. -on -one -on -one. Binbag versus Liliana versus Loki, a.k.a. Vacatus. I, I think we should go to Liliana's lair, where Vacatus is, and we can and kill two birds with one stone, how are we by which kill I mean we kill them both stone? with a big stone. We'll just hit them with a big stone. <laughs> They're both extremely powerful. We just we just barely won a fight against Vacatus. I, and if he, he gets Liliana's really magic, defeated. we're never going to be able to beat him. How are we going to defeat them both? Drop a big stone on them. Uh, well, we get them to listening. kill each other. Yes, in a magical duel. Uh, Liliana wouldn't fall for that. 
She's too bright. And <laughs> so she can do like that that cloud of daggers deal. Yeah, mm. remember the cloud of yeah. daggers? It minced the whole room. Yeah. I'm saying we're gonna have to fight whoever wins, which yeah. is tough. Yeah. Whoever wins. Or we they'll lose. be all tired out after the magical duel, and then we can just easy picking. <laughs> also, we have to fight whoever wins, but we have to fight them both if we don't if they don't face off against each other. Yeah. What if they like you know are into it? What if they start making out and join forces, and then we have oh, to fight no, them both? We're in real trouble. <laughs> Who's Jesus. making out? Says Katie, ar- arriving with two drinks. She says, here, babe, they were out of yak milk. I got you a smoothie. It tastes oh. better. Don't worry about it. Okay, yeah. thanks very much. Uh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Whack the smoothie wait, 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 out wait, wait, of his hand. I hit it, it out of bitter? his hand. Meryl Wen. <laughs> please, please. I really like her and she really likes me. Can't you just try and She's trying to me? poison you, Dob. It's okay, Dob. I get it. Jealousy is a powerful thing. Look. Look, there's only Ooh. one. There's only Ooh. one. Okay, Katie, let's let's unpick that. <laughs> no, no, shall no, no, we? There's one easy, she simple a straw way. Up the inside of the pearl head is like. There's one easy, Ooh. simple way to solve this problem. Someone drink the yak milk. Someone drink <laughs> it now. I drink it. Thank you. <laughs> I'm making notes no, no, for no. my um for my best man speech. It was smoothies. It was smoothies. They were out of yak milk. Oh, they're out of yak milk. It was just a super green smoothie. All right, someone drink the super green but gross smoothie. But it's on the floor. That's true. I mean, again. Egbert, take a little bit of this green smoothie. I I lick it off the floor. Is it... Am I in love with Katie Pearlhead now? No. It does taste a bit bitter, but no, you're not in love with Katie Pearlhead. It seems okay. It tastes a bit of floor and a bit of bitter. But it could be full of... Poison, dog poison, the things he's allergic to. Mm. Yeah. It's true. We should have I mean, really let dog drink I, it. And then I, go, I go. Why would to... I do that? Why would I try and kill my fiance? Uh, because you were having conversations <laughs> about, like. No prenup, Katie prenup. Pearlhead? Yeah. But, but what's, a, what's a prenup matter if he dies? I I'd... want to marry him. I want him to live. Yeah. It Thank does you, matter Katie. if he dies. Katie, you shouldn't you have get. to explain yourself. I drop to the floor Thank and start licking the, uh, <laughs> licking the drink <laughs> off of the floor and say, <laughs> and say you, you are all making me feel very embarrassed right now. This is all gold for the best man. You're, emba- you're embarrassing yourself. You're, you're, you're all embarrassing yourself. I watched Dob. It tastes a bit bitter and a lot like floor. Yeah. Well, I told you. I think that was right. Well, now we're all poisoned i guess we, there's nothing to do but proceed katie maybe we could use a, a fresh pair of eyes on this situation okay yeah i'm great with uh situations uh i catch uh I, I, and 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 if it is it's helpful maybe everyone could agree that, that that was a helpful thing like with the sort of dagger kick that that was uh, i know. think yeah i think it's good and if dob is happy then i'm happy i say as i continue writing right. my best man speech <laughs> 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 um yeah, uh, uh, okay. I apprise uh, Katie of the situation uh, as best I understand it. Um, In Katie, many ways, uh, Dob was the wind beneath my wings, <laughs> <laughs> allowing me to soar to reach the heights I did by soaring slightly Sorry, less than lower. What's your best man suit what? gonna be? My best man suit? Well, I, I need to. I obviously need to go and see my, my tailor. Um, but I mean, it kind of depends on what the the groom is going to be wearing. I obviously want to. Wear something complimentary. He'll be wearing a half orc suit. Uh, I mean, uh, Corazon, I I was hoping you could help me out with that, to be honest. I don't know anything about fashion and I want to look nice on my big day. So I thought maybe you could, would you you be up for like designing outfits? It would be an honour. It would be the great honour of my life. The whole wedding party? Yes, absolutely. Sweet. All right, Um, well, we've got our quest for today. (laughs) This is important stuff. Yeah, and we're supposed to look at a few venues because we don't know if we want like a big thing with sort of like, lots of family Plus, and friends. I mean the stag well, thing, which I will be organising. So, I mean, yeah. guys, we've got the solution right here, and that is an apocalyptic party yeah. growing over the earth. The whole planet's going to be saying a party. That could so do you won't have the, to organise a stag for the stag oh, do. Oh, fun! <laughs> we could piggyback on the apocalyptic party. Yeah, that's true. That will save, save so much trouble. Yeah, and and money, which but, you know, I mean, gotta be, gotta be frugal. <laughs> I mean, if it were me in your situation with the whole Vacatus Liliana thing, oh, yeah, that's I, yeah. I would just draw them both in. You've been quite devious in the past. Yeah, just Katie. draw them both in close and then slit their throats while they're not expecting it. And then, bingo, bango, you're the queen. Why don't we, I think we should go, but, they're going to be have their meeting where they're going to fight each other for the magic. And we can just observe from high up. And then when one person is done and all, they're dead. And the other person is all half dead. Then we'll finish the job. 
Okay. Just drop out of the just shadows. Slit the throat. Okay. Just That's everyone good. fine with Kay yeah. Bellhead saying draw them close and then slit the throat. Yeah. Fine. Yes. I'm not, I'm not I, fine yeah. with that, Egbert. I'm Egbert, she was talking rasty. about Voca, Vocatus and right, Liliana. De- and definitely yeah. not, mm-hmm. not to you. That's I practically the road throat, motto. Egbert. And actually, I find it quite offensive that you consider <laughs> that sinister. <laughs> okay, fine. Just side check. Well, um, I mean, we can probably find some magical way to divine Liliana's location using this handy dandy hair that I'm hesitant to bring up again but I, I it, can't think of any other leads why is it unless you mouth? want it like hit with a stick I can't help you I'm magic free as of several days ago I don't know if locate object would work on this unless, unless I she's to within find... a thousand feet yeah no. if she's within a thousand feet and I'm like locating her hair very specifically in bag <laughs> I told you, who's the most magical person we know? Who's the best? Come on then, bin bag. Who's the greatest wizard of them all? Me, <laughs> it's me. No, all right. no, it's me. I'll do it. Oh, I will. How hard can it be to locate a person using magic? I just need okay, to try really hard. Just don't burn up the hair and destroy it in your attempt. It's times like this I wish we knew a psychic. I feel okay. like we don't know enough psychics. We should I've, move in more psychics. Up. I would like to touch the hair and try and use all of my magic. Don't so, accidentally okay. get grease on it. Corey. What Do magic? Do you have the fifth level divination spell scrying? Wait, let me check. <laughs> Say yes. <laughs> it would be the ultimate chorus on the <laughs> Of that? Of course I have scrying. Uh, yes. Here's the, here's the spell cards. You uh, lie. Uh, mm-hmm. Why would you so, lie? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Are you telling the truth, Corazon? Scry- mm-hmm. Scrying right there. Yeah, I feel mm-hmm. like... I, f- I cast zone of truth on Corazon. <laughs> Okay, I don't have the spell per, per <laughs> se, um, but with, heavy... <laughs> with my incredible reserves of wild magic, I feel like I could replicate it with, let me just, just. Mm. Anything happening? There's a sudden clap of thunder. No! Yeah! No! Yeah! No! Who no! no! summons me? Feel back. like I hug him immediately. Uh. <laughs> oh. oh, I see. It's Bin a heroine. Hello. Is the tree in danger? Why does it seem so <laughs> tense here? What's going on? There's a lot of stuff. A lot of um, stuff. Before we do stuff. anything, it's not um, me- not very tense, but a lot of furniture. <laughs> be- before we do, before we do it, uh, is we this conduct, why I was summoned? Before we conduct any other business. Tight five. Bin bag. <laughs> Katie, Katie, the wizard bin bag. Hello. I want I want you to meet all my friends, and this is a really good friend of mine. <laughs> a pleasure, uh, my lady. Head. Oh, she hadn't said my lady. <laughs> apart from that bin bag. <laughs> Did I do something wrong? No, no, it's fine. It's fine. Okay. So, bin bag. Uh, hmm. Do you uh, happen to know any spells for locating a person if you have a strand of their hair? Is that something you can do? Why, yes. It's ah. a, a simple fifth level spell of the divination school. Divination Anyone scrying. worth their salt should know it. Yeah. <laughs> ah, you do know it. I do, you, I do, I do know it, yeah. He yeah. knows of it. He Can you do it, it, chicken kicking pirate man? Uh, it's a little beneath my level. Um, Is like it beneath focus you, more on ah. bag? I like Still to focus scrub, more on I large. See. Uh, no, no, no. I focus more on uh, the kind of no, theoretical no, magic. Said... You know, I like yes. to work within the. the In I theory, the if you applied things. yourself, you could do some magic. I agree. Binbag, I have one more question. If it's cool, um, we don't take up loads of your time. This freaking guy! I swear to God. Uh, uh, Prudence, uh, unfortunately, lost her magic. Lost it. Um, because, I mean, you probably, she left you it probably noticed the expanding party town. We're on it. You don't have to worry about that with dealing with the situation. A trickster but, like, took it. In, in your opinion, what's the way to get that back? Do we? I lost my connection to Cthulhu. How do we reforge it? Do we oh. have to? Warlock without a without a patron. Do That's we have to kill Vakatus, or is there another way? I know. I'm bummed out. That yes, is, we put it in um, in the wizard circles. Um, uh, yeah, if you just wail on this va- va- vacacious, vaca- vacacious, vacacious, yes. vacation, yeah, um, until uh, he just sort of gives gives up. The like a magic, magic pinata, I hit him till magic comes out. Precisely, yes. Of course. And your connection shall be restored. Of course. Why did we stop so hitting simple. him? Okay. Uh, all right. Well, I mean, uh, Binbag, if you wouldn't mind doing us a solid, we would owe you big time, and. Um, if I might be so bold, 
I can extend an invite to you with a plus one to the wedding of the season. <laughs> Ooh. Mm-hmm. Who's? I look over at Katie. Is that cool? Sorry. <laughs> Probably should have talked about that first. Fine. Fine. Yeah, it's fine. Do you have, like, a gift registry or, you know, while we're at it? You nah, know, we're oh, not materialistic like that, oh, are we? Yeah. <laughs> you know, our wizards were so busy during daylight hours. What if I, you just came, what if I just came as an evening guest, Dob? As an evening guest? Mm. Inbag, I'm not going to get married without you there. <laughs> well, then, you've twisted my arm. <laughs> Uh, yeah, Katie can be in touch with the gift register. I think she's taking care of all that side of things. Um, anyway, here's I'm, the I'm hair. I'm starting to rework the best man speech to be a bin bag roast. <laughs> <laughs> savage bin <laughs> Savage roast. <laughs> Why are my ears burning? What is that great scratching sound? Oh, nothing, nothing. <laughs> Let me just write that. That's what it sounded like. Oh. We all thought it. <laughs> Anyway, yeah, if you could do that magical location thing, here's the here's the hair. Sure. But he just kind of goes. Uh, oh. and like, and just curls it up on his tongue. And goes, uh, I'll do I'll do some scrying of my own as well while he's doing. Uh, um, um, uh, um, and then. Mm-hmm. He goes, ah, oh, yes, I have it now. <gasps> um, well, uh, what is it seems, oh, well, she's good looking. <laughs> you hear it from the other side. Uh, I mean, Awkward. Uh, for, um, <laughs> you know, for someone so plain. <laughs> But, uh... Good recovery, Bimbag. <laughs> I high five Bimbag. <laughs> Please, the spell. Oh. Uh, what else can you see, Bimbag? <laughs> well, she seems to be aboard a ship. Uh -huh. um, also I'll, getting a ship, uh, actually, a ship. Uh, hold on. Um, ah. Um, he drags over a cauldron of wine, like. <laughs> You see the sort Bimbag, of... Bimbag, this is no time to start the drinking. The concerned mob are like... Ah, ah, this is exactly ah, the time hey. to start drinking. And sort of dipping into it. And then he goes, ah, waves a hand over it. And what he is seeing through this scrying spell uh, appears in... He's basically made a makeshift scrying pool. Mm. Wow. Um, hmm. the, the picture is frequently broken up by people dipping their goblets in to get more wine out. But generally speaking, they're enjoying the show as well. You can see Liliana um, actually sat at like a captain's table consulting maps and charts uh, you see kind of a lot of uh, a lot of uh, bits of parchment that seem to be updates on sort of your whereabouts in the past etc etc and then uh, you notice that there is a sea chart uh, with like stabbed through the middle with a dagger which is a horrible misuse of a map when they're not easy to replicate um, the location where you two last encountered one another and sort of had your little tussle at sea oh yeah because uh, uh, then that goes well. That's there's your there's your target there, and let me just uh, hold on. He puts a finger in either side of the bowl and just sort of pinches together. He goes, <laughs> and it starts to zoom out, <laughs> um, and it kind of shows like almost like a camera is withdrawing. You then kind of like woof. You see the deck of a ship. Um, it's the inevitability, mm. funnily enough. Um, uh -huh. He goes, uh, well, let's keep going, keep going, and he kind of keeps spooling out until. Uh, you notice that there is a, basically you're looking at an aerial map of Geth and you can sort of see a little trail of the waves being disturbed by sort of the bow wave of the inevitability. It seems to be travelling west toward uh, a port you know oh very well. In fact, you've got property there. Oh! Necropolis on sea? More like Necropolis on sieged as in Ooh. laid Siege 2 by Liliana, who's trying to kill us. I walk in and I, and I say, everyone I've described it and they're going to Necropolis on Sea. I use my power. Well, it sucks to be her because the only person there is... Oh, no, Bismuth! Bismuth! Oh, Bismuth! Bismuth! No. She can Bismuth? handle herself. Now, that's a name I've not heard in a while. Well, uh, you have a plus one, Binbag, <laughs> to the wedding of the season. 
Time to rekindle. I think it's time I gave Bismuth a call. No. <laughs> <laughs> no this is the end. We need to get we need to get back there to the ancestral it man's. What's what wrong if, with this wine? Oh, it's party, everything. Yeah, it's party everything wine. is wrong with it. Yeah. It's like alive, and is a monster. It will yeah. make it will make you want to build a party town. Yeah, don't drink it. Mm. Stop drinking it. I quite like. To... Mm. All right. Well. I should, I should... Okay. No. That's all yeah. right. Fine. Can Can you d do your teleporting thing? I mean, I do it, but I just use mm -hmm. uh, my spell slots there with the powerful scrying. I did. <laughs> Well, we'll teleport you where? To Necropolis on Sea. That's oh. where Liliana's going. Okay. Uh, sure. If you want to go to Necropolis on Sea. Uh... Come on, Bimbag, a wizard mm. of your stature, etc., etc. Let's do this. Well, you just get less <laughs> and less flattering, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> It'll be a chance for you to drop in on Bismuth and see. Otherwise, yes. what if Liliana and uh, old I, chicken legs get there? I can't drop in on Bismuth looking like this. Are you mad? <gasps> you Wait, look lovely! You look nice. yes. oh, Funny you mention it, um, Binbag, because actually uh, Dob and I were just about to go to the tailors. We were going to get <laughs> our hair done. Maybe, yeah, they were um, going to like do a montage makeover. So if you want to join us, Binbag, for the yeah. montage makeover. It doesn't mm. have to be a montage. It could be exquisitely detailed. <laughs> <laughs> exquisitely detailed role playing. <laughs> <laughs> hmm, an entire day of activities with the incredibly rude pirate. Enjoy Necropolis on sea! No. Oh, he just smashes his hands together. <laughs> and there's, with a <laughs> you are transported to uh, somewhere a little bit down the coast of Necropolis on sea. You can kind of see it uh, as if you were looking at a, a, a sort of a holiday parchment, which is sort of just sort of a small rectangular parchment that people mm. buy in popular locations to send to their friends <laughs> while they're on holiday. Uh, I look out to sea. Can I can I see I a sail? Old or? ones. Uh, <laughs> um, he made me a wisdom perception check. Let's have a look. Well, I've got a widow's walk in the house. If you want to try and see from up there, it's probably. Uh, no need, Corazon. There's a, a what? Sorry. A critical one. There's a widow's walk in the. Where is it? In the house. Oh, fun! It's just I rolled a, a one. One of the many original architectural features. Dob, what? You rolled a one. I rolled a one. Yeah. Okay. Uh, <laughs> also, did we? We probably should have talked about it first. But did Binbag bring Katie? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she was just quizzing Corazon on the widow's walk. Yeah, she's into yeah. widow's walks. We make a mental note. Yeah. Cool. yeah. Super into widow's walks, are we? Mm. <laughs> uh, you rolled a one. Yeah. Uh, you look into the, the land. <laughs> yeah. I missed the whole it. widow's walk conversation because <laughs> I'm like trying to. See a ship mm. using my hands as a telescope. Corazon, you've got an actual telescope. Can you see anything out there at sea? Well, let's have a look. Um, Katie, just out of interest, what's your favourite spider? <laughs> oh, I don't, I don't know. I think they're all pretty great. Um, <laughs> they are all pretty great. We have so yeah, much. If you had common. to choose. <laughs> <laughs> wait, 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 Katie. Let me answer for you. It will be a test of our uh, romantic. Both say, oh it, say, it, say it at the same time. Oh my god. Let's say, we'll say it on time. three. Let's we'll say it on three. Yeah. <laughs> One. Two, three. three. <laughs> no, you ain't gonna see. You ain't gonna see. You ain't gonna see. I angrily scan the horizon. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> what do you yeah, see, what? Corazon? I cast yeah, yeah, Druidcraft around Katie for a smell of skunk. <laughs> oh, Meryl <laughs> one. It's petty, but she's I like just it. annoying me so much. <laughs> Well, if you, you thought see, that was... you see the orb kind of look down and around and then just sort of slowly like pan up to you, Meryl, then. Mm -hmm. There's no nose exactly. holes in the orb. Uh -huh. exactly. she no <laughs> but she knows what you've oh, done. Yeah. <laughs> I, I don't mind. I want her to know. <laughs> I'm like... Okay, now. <laughs> Corazon, so how's that? Can you see any ships or what? <laughs> so, uh, yeah, Corazon, talk to me. Uh, What'd you roll? Wisdom perception, please. Okay, with okay, ten. Okay, you can see the shape uh, of uh, the inevitability mm. coming towards you. Um, you reckon it's about an hour and a half out of uh, of port, with the way the wind's blowing and sort of the headway they're making. Um, as you watch, you can't you can't quite make out what it is, what's going on, but. Uh, as you as it gets closer to Necropolis on the sea, you kind of see the the railing sort of starting to get crowded. It's almost like a large number of um, figures are coming up on deck, possibly to prepare for something. You don't know. Mm. All right. Yep, I can see it. They're prepping for something. They're about an hour and a half out. 
I, I guess Vocatus isn't on board yet. Otherwise, probably more stuff would be going on. Well, I mean, we, we gave Vocatus a, a, a pretty significant beatdown. That's true. Like, Maybe he's if, healing up. If I was Vocatus, I would be off, you know. We thought we gave strength. him a beatdown, but did we really? He, he was trying to hoodwink. Awesome. The name of Liliana out of us, right? Yeah. So that was his game all along. We don't know how weakened a state he's in right now. Oh, speaking of, I cast cure wounds on Egbert. That's good. Thank you. Speaking yeah, cool. Of yeah, yeah, go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, go for it. I, just, I don't even say anything. I try and do it so Egbert doesn't even notice. I just put my hand. Aww. Just there's like. Uh, deck stealth and uh, wisdom perception on oh. you, please, Egbert. Mm -hmm. Like you're patting him on the uh, back. Wisdom yeah, perception, yeah. you say? Okay. What about my significant damage? <laughs> That's a 14 <laughs> minus one. I got an eight. Oh, oh you notice it, all right? Oh. Dub's, Dub's trying to heal you, sort of on the on on the quiet. You That's can heal. Fine. You can heal me out in the open. It's any of nice. you, if you want. <laughs> it's nice of him. I appreciate it. I Corazon, it. I don't have any magic, and I don't have healing magic at the best of times. Sh Corazon, but... surely the the light grays of four points of damage is just naturally just ticked up. All right, yeah. By now, I, re I replenish four over? points of damage by eating a large sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, fine. Uh, does Dob need to roll for how much I how much damage I recover? Or... Yes. Yeah, I think I do. Um, I guess because I'm being sneaky, I'm only going to send this out of a first level slot. Hey. Okay, all right, all right fine, second, fine. second, second. Uh, well, you, friend, just recovered nine points of damage. Which is cool. nearly, That's nearly right, what I... That's right, it was 15 points of damage, 15, wasn't it? was 15, 15 points of damage last previously. time, right. So. That's all right. Yeah. So it's fine. Okay, now, Egbert, you do, now you do me. <laughs> so. All right. Uh, I don't have any level two slots left, so hard luck. Um, but I will do, I will do cure wounds. Um, oh, boy. 1d8 plus spell casting modifier. It's a shame we don't have time for a long rest between now and when Liliana arrives. Yeah, it's only an hour and a half, right? It's not very long. <laughs> we don't need. We don't need to. We can just he keep healing each so other. So we need to. What's the plan? Are we going to lay right. low? I think we need to go find hide? business, and okay. we need to ask her if there's anything about the house that we should know when it comes to fortifications and defences. Because if anyone's going to know of any secret things, it's going to be her. Mm. Yeah, Clearly and also, the reason that Liliana has come here is to get us. Because she, yeah. she must have assumed this was where we would Right, come. right, mm. right, right. Dob, you have five points additional. Nice. Cues. Thanks, Egbert. No worries. Uh, and also, when we find Bismuth, we should um, take care to clear up her availability and dietary preferences. Because <laughs> we need to nail Ooh, down inviting this Inviting the ex to the wedding. All right. Bismuth? With Dob, oh, were you sorry, and Bismuth? I Liliana. Uh... Whoa, I was whoa, 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 when did this happen? Whoa. At this point, it Meryl, when I told you that me. in confidence. <laughs> <laughs> Katie, it was bef before. Oh, boy. Can't even. Well, let's yeah. go meet Bismuth, I guess. Dirty yeah. dog. Get them all. <laughs> <laughs> See how many more I'm going to meet today. Bugs, am I right? <laughs> 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 Uh, okay, right. well, let's go to the house. Uh, let's go to the house. I mean, we can try and fortify it, you know, with traps against Liliana. But what of Vocatus? But but how about this? Why bother? She's so strong. She'll kill us easily. <laughs> <laughs> You're right. We should simply lie down and wait for death. I lie down. <laughs> no, come on. The house is the house will protect me and yeah. by extension you. The house is quite powerful. We're, we're the rightful yeah. owners of the house. Yeah. Through Corazon. Am, am, oh, yeah, Katie, yeah. I forgot Corazon, to mention. Through Corazon. I forgot and to mention that we have a, 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 like a sort of title deed of inheritance uh, to this we, sweet... We, 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 quite we, accurate. So, so we're, get up, we're, we're, we're too young to die. We're not even married yet. <laughs> oh, Katie, and I, I miss you. <laughs> you know I can't die until I've married you. <laughs> and I stand up. Uh, okay. So sweet. <laughs> <laughs> All right, fortifications. Well, let's get, I mean, let's get in the house. And let's go. All right, let's we walk in. to Necropolis on Sea through the let's graveyard. Have, let's have Katie go in the house first. <laughs> it's fine, I All go right. in first. It's my house. Katie's no, no, a no, 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 no. I, The rest of us are fine, I think. Katie's, Katie's a rad not adventurer. there with a crossbow. <laughs> oh, okay. That's good. Despite her usual habits. You walk in to find actually that. Um, I mean, the house uh, already, you know, as you all remember the last time you were here, you did some extensive, uh, very awkward painting of the walls and mm -hmm. you did it up to look quite nice. It, you know, it, it looks like um, it's re regained some of its former glory. And uh, as you walk in, it smells delicious in here. You can smell, you know, sort of uh, 
uh, roasting fowl. You can smell um, delicious meats and uh, sauces bubbling away. And is that fresh bread you th- you smell? Immediately, you're, you know, your mouths start watering, your stomachs start grumbling. Um, mm. The, yeah, the house smells absolutely Aww. delicious. And off to one of the rooms, one of the one of the larger dining rooms, the one with the chandelier that took you quite so long to polish, mm. all of you, when doing up the house. Uh, you can hear a lot of sort of clattering and a sort of a, a strange... Uh, it sounds like wailing at first, but you've just been a- away from home for a long time. It's just... Aww. <laughs> oh, Corazon, I miss this big spooky mansion. Yeah. I fling open the door and I say, what the bloody hell? Ah! Oh, that's right, Bismuth. Bismuth. I can turn up at any time. Never relax. <laughs> I, I can physically. I can't relax. Good. <laughs> I've not slept in sixty years, and uh, in many ways, I shall never know peace. <laughs> Surprise inspection! I say, and I put like, <laughs> like, along one of the surfaces. It's absolutely spotless. I trust everything is to your satisfaction. I didn't realize you would be joining us for dinner. What, who is this dinner who's for? Who's us? What do you mean? Yeah, who's this dinner for if not us? Well, you, your your friend came by and said that you'd offered him loan of the house for a it. weekend. And oh, that I was no. to prepare a, a, a romantic dinner for two. Describe this friend. Uh, Describe well. his legs. <laughs> <laughs> well, his they're very nice, sort of shapely. What shape? The shape of the chicken? Okay, like the feathery? top of them, you know. Uh. Oh, uh, uh, well, they were feathery. Yeah. Yes. It kind of seemed a little like he'd had a recent trim, but his knees bent backwards. I remember that. Mm. And, uh, why? Why? Bloody Vocatus. I mean, Who's... yeah, Vocatus, it said your friend. You, he's, he's not our friend. Bismuth, you can't just let anyone who turns up and has chicken legs and says they're my friend. You can't just let them come and live in my house. But he no, said that Actually, he... if all those conditions are met. <laughs> <laughs> he said that you'd lend him all sorts of things. Like, he even did, like, a cool eldritch magic. Oh, to say, no. Bruce lent me some stuff. Okay, he He's using all your magic. He's touching all your magic with his no. gross hands. I had it just the way I liked it. It's all, all going to be weird. weird. Oh, no. Yeah. Yeah, it's a different colour now. No! <laughs> what colour is it? How dare uh, you! Rainbows? No! <laughs> it's just sort of like a, a rich, imperious blue. Uh, blue, Lovely. the worst colour. <laughs> okay. Now, who's Vacatus thinking he's having a romantic dinner with then? Bismuth? I don't know. It's just is it told Liliana? Me, prepare Liliana, dinner for two. It? Make sure there are people at the docks to kind of come. come he's going to use his tricks to wilds right back. on Liliana, hmm. I bet. He's going to seduce yeah. her with his trickster ways. His trickster. I don't ask the wares and wife was of your comings and goings. They're complicated enough as it is. Mm. We're That's selling true. the house. That's We're not Christmas. selling the house. I am very we are complicated. We love the ghosts. We hate the ghosts. Poor yeah, old no. We're complicated. Yeah, We're really? mysterious and cool. We don't well, recognize I'll the ghost's say. existence. Yeah. Well, look, you're here now. and it's... Bismuth, where Call is, it... is Vacatus now? I don't know. He said he was going he went out. away from... Yeah. Okay. So I'm going out. <laughs> Cook dinner for two. So right. I'm obvious. I mean, I didn't. He didn't say what they wanted. So I'd say there's probably food for sixty. Okay. Uh, should I set places at the table no. for you? No. But I will but have some food though. Thank you. Well, it's not ready yet. Make me up a plate, business. No, does dinner's not served yet. <laughs> he said, make him up a plate. The master is the table. <laughs> you did the table or not at all? Okay. So, right. Okay. Okay. So. Okay. We, okay. So. But yeah. Later then, on, we can make comically large sandwiches if you want. I would like that very much, yes. But Great. before then... I was talking to Egbert. Yes, Aww. please. Great. Vacatus. Where's, where's your dog? I do have some scotch eggs left. It's oh, not yeah, a dog, is... but he is here. Your like... dog. <laughs> yeah. He's never been a dog. Oh, but... A little sea dog. But That's he'll have the scotch dog. eggs, gladly. What about dog? big round dog. Dogbert. <laughs> Do I need to cast Fine Steed as well? No, no. Have, oh, Think no, of your no. spell slots. I don't have any spell slots left. <laughs> <laughs> well, <laughs> you're not summoning any steed. Okay. Here. Do we need to be in hiding for when Liliana and Vocatus? Yeah, will Liliana and Vocatus are going to have a, a powwow here. They're going to have a they're going to have a sit down meeting, and then we okay. burst out the cake. Yes. What cake? Step one. We bake Step a one, cake. Bake a cake with a hole in it. <laughs> no, step one is burst out. Oh, you, you need the cake to burst out of. <laughs> you plan weird. 
they're going okay they're gonna have a sit down meeting in here okay and we can we can set it up so we're ready to get them yeah we're in the suits of armor yeah around this edge of the room yes and there's a big <laughs> chandelier nice. we could probably rig some sort of trap on, on that right yeah. can rig up the jury rig this chandelier to drop okay all right we need to bear in mind that they're both powerful incredibly wizards. powerful magic what do we think vacatus's plan is to to trick liliana and steal her magic probably rather than make a kind of genuine alliance right yes yeah Agreed. i think he needs to like i'm guessing he needs to make contact with her so he's gonna you know butter up a little bit and like maybe like at some point reach forward and you know touch her hand and then <laughs> done yeah, yeah. so like he's trying to set her at song. ease well, here's what I'm thinking is that they're both so strong. I'm a little bit scared to be in the room with either of them, uh-huh. let alone both of them. That's what but I if, said. but if we can uh, like somehow inform Liliana that she's being tricked, uh. maybe she can at least go to the <gasps> meeting with that knowledge. Oh, Act you want to or... do a enemy of my enemy sort of Why deal? Why would Liliana trust us? We're her hated enemy. We can offer her proof. Can we? Yes. How? Uh, if, we're full of, <laughs> if we put our minds to it, we okay, can. Okay. We can achieve <laughs> anything. <laughs> we can okay. Achieve anything. Uh, yeah. We, well. Uh, all right. Well, what do we? Uh, well. Um. Hmm. The orb. The orb. Do we still have the orb? Does it exist? I mean, it, it, fl- it flattened out like a you know, like a flattened oh, sphere, sphere. Um. We can have Egbert cast Zone of Truth on us. Uh, and we have Liliana to be in the same room as Zone Liliana. Of Truth on Egbert. And then Liliana will cl- cast Cloud of Daggers on us, and then we'll die a bit. We get aboard the ship, and we and we say, Liliana, you could kill us, but we can offer you something. <laughs> and then she'll kill yeah. us. No, but we can offer you something much more valuable. Wouldn't you like to steal Vocatus' Voc- magic? But then and... she'll steal Vocatus' magic. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and so then, you see the problem. And th- th- then the can is kicked very much down the road. <laughs> <laughs> no. Okay. We can just see what happens with this dinner and then yeah. deal with the winner later on. We can all get behind paintings and look through the eye holes. <gasps> we can okay. hide in the clown painting. <laughs> I'm not getting near that clown painting. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <I'm> get- <laughs> It'd be nice to pop back to that mountain top. Oh. Do you know there's a whole painted world? We could just. I bet there's no Liliana in the painted world. We could just <laughs> All right, to... we go and live in the painted world. <laughs> the end. All right, the welcome end. to episode no! one. Of the, adventure <laughs> the painted, painted world. world. Episode one. The clowns and wolves are friends now. <laughs> oh no. Okay. Work in progress. Do, do we want to just hide and let this thing play out, or do we want to intervene with Liliana, who is approaching us rapidly on a ship? Anyway? Maybe we should have options to intervene, but actually Can... we should see what goes down between these two because then we'll maybe get an inkling of who is the most powerful out of the two yeah mm. who is the all right okay threat. we'll set up every possible trap we'll rig the chandelier we'll poison mm. all the food we'll hide bomb in the blamange crossbow yep. bolts in all the furniture and then if if things start to go evil team up we'll hit the button and all the traps will go off at once liliana yeah. doesn't share power i don't th- i think mm-hmm. a team up is out of the question or affection yeah, right. Yeah, dog, right? <laughs> uh, so, Corazon, you were detailing the plan, I think. <laughs> <laughs> we turn this into a trap chamber. Mm, okay. Mm, Corazon mm. trap dungeon. And everything's rigged. Okay, I'm going to start rigging up traps. I'm going to rig the chandelier to drop when I press a button. And I'm going to go to bismuth. the poison cellar and poison, put yeah. poison in the food. Oh, no, let's, let's. Bismuth can poison the food. Bis- bismuth, uh, she probably has already. Bismuth is coming back into the room with a plate of scotch eggs. Like, and here's the kibble for the dog. Yes. And will Aww. anyone be bursting out of a cake this evening? Yes. All right. So, dog, <laughs> we'll put a cake in the corner and you can be poised in it, ready to burst out. <laughs> yep, 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 yep. Arm to the teeth. <laughs> yep. Also, uh, I should be setting places for dinner. No, no, no. We're, no, it's, no, 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 no. It's an exciting murder dinner now, um, Bismuth. Oh. Don't, don't mention it to the to the other guests. To the guests, oh, no. Do you, do you also, want to spoil your poisoning the food, I bet? Yeah. Yeah. Well, Have you got any, goes... any wizard poison? What's wizard poison? Just anything that's particularly effective on wizards. Well, who's a wizard? Who's coming? Oh, we're just some wizards. A mage? Well, a, we don't know I was what... Told to, I was told to prepare dinner for two. I wasn't told about wizards. Yeah, we don't... We, yeah, we, well... Hmm. <laughs> what? We've got two mad, two powerful magic users. Vocatus, mm. Liliana coming to dinner. 
Okay. We want to set a load of traps for them because we don't like either of them, it turns out. So right. you need to poison the food. We'll do the chandelier. Maybe some, I don't know, spike traps. But maybe the, the house can chip in. The house right, well, is well, like well, well. a malevolent yeah. entity all of its own. Yeah. So let's let's just let's just uh, in, in let's just role play it. Okay, you're Liliana. You walk into the house. You've been told you've been a mysterious summons, right? Come and, and meet here for a dinner. All right, I'm Liliana. Du- you're Liliana. Du- 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 the chandelier du- falls du- on you. Oh what, no! What chandelier has fallen on me. I yeah. use my incredible magic to not be harmed by the falling chandelier. Sure. You walk into the room. Uh, yes. Vacatus is there. He's probably sat down at the table. Then uh-huh. a bunch of spikes fire out of the walls at you. Uh-huh. This is. I use my incredible magic to not be harmed Vic- by the. Dob- Vacatus gonna- is like. <laughs> Dob. This isn't going to be a sequential thing. It's all going to happen at once. The chandelier is above the dinner table. The poison will be acting on their insides. You will burst out of the cake. What I'm going to do is there's a large painting over the fireplace. I'm going to like paint myself into it in an action pose. But really, I'm just covered in paint and I'll look at them. And then when, when it all goes off, I'll jump in with cutlasses drawn. Um, there's going to be a cannon down one end. That'll go off. They're going to be hit by like 16 traps at once, Dob. It's flawless. Hmm. A sequential trap dungeon. Yeah. Do you know how the house can do illusions, though? Illusions, powerful illusions. I mean, can it anymore? Is it still doing that? I don't know. Commune with the house, Corazon. It's your ancestral home. Well, I don't. I mean, it's hot and cold running the illusions in here. I never know when yeah, they're going to have to. Oh, we could, uh, we could make the house do an illusion uh, so that. Uh, when Liliana <gasps> walks in, she meets an illusory Yes, Vicartus we have two and parallel v- dining rooms. And Vocatus meets an illusory <laughs> Liliana. Yes, it's a Mrs. Doubtfire situation. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. and we'll two be the waiters. Dinners. Yeah. Well, Liliana maybe doesn't even know who she's there to meet. So she could just be like, he, she could be, Liliana could be showing up just for like a sort of a... To a murder si- us, as usual. Yeah, right? a sit down That's truce. why she's here. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I um, was going to say. Very- right. I could disguise myself as Vacatus and or Liliana. Yeah. And but I could what? run back and forth between the two. I could just run back and forth, Mrs. Doubtfire style, between the two dinners, being Vacatus and yes. Liliana. That's a but given, yeah. Corazon, but what does Bismuth have to say about Sorry, all yes. this? Well, <laughs> I assume you know about the ship that's approaching. Mm-hmm. Yes. Yes. Oh, yes. yeah. You do know it's bristling with, like, People who look like warriors. Uh, oh, mm-hmm. this, is a, this, this is a two-person. Tables dinner. are set for like sixty people, right? Yeah. No, yeah. it's set for two. I two, asked you. Two. Oh, two. Liliana two. won't be showing up to a, a, a meet with with two people with a, with a whole entourage. She's powerful enough that she doesn't need it, and she wouldn't want any information slipping out to her underlings. But my point is, does she even know that she's coming to meet? Meet with anyone? Or no, I think she's, she's just coming. I think she's here for a siege, siege, and then yeah. he's gonna go out That's and be like, "Why am I Hang cooking on. dinner?" That's a good point, Bismuth. Okay, well, well, we can still do the plan. We just need to invite Liliana to dinner. Yeah, <laughs> I think Vic- 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 is going to invite her to dinner. Vic- 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 imagines he's going to sweet talk Liliana into a dinner. Yeah, I don't know if Dob wants to ask someone to dinner, he should. <gasps> Katie. Well, on. there's I think the would... plan, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Dob, it's finally your chance to ask Liliana to dinner. You should go and meet her on the beach. Finally. And... Uh, yeah, okay. With Liliana. Would going down to the beach get me out of this room right now? <laughs> <laughs> yes. So... Bismuth, I would like you to set up two parallel dinners in two of the <laughs> dining rooms. Well... This is Doubtfire style. Okay, I'm gonna have to halve the menus. Well, there's food for sixty, so yes. But now there's only food for thirty twice. That's fine. fine. Am I poisoning all of it? Oh please, (laughs) as much as possible. Wait, no. Keep the bread bread rolls unpoisoned because I may need to eat for verisimilitude. (laughs) Okay. Okay. It's a very good. so it's a very good plan, Bismuth. <laughs> Stop doing, no, what's doing going things that make it yeah, seem yeah, yeah. like it's not a good plan. Okay, Bismuth let's... turns into a motorbike and just <laughs> just re- revs her way out of the room. It's a perfectly simple plan, everybody. We, Dob? The, 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 the house creates uh-huh. the, uh, il- two separate illusory dinners. When Liliana shows up, uh, yes. she, is, she is met there. Uh, yes. By uh, she doesn't know she's there to meet Vicartus, so so that no. could be anything. That could be me. That could be like yeah. But would it... she just kill you? Nah, no. not do- have you met 
that Dob, he's very charming and yeah. charismatic. He'll talk his way out of trouble. Yeah, and I'm sure Corazon can rig me some kind of escape um, rope. Like a if bungee. Get a bungee, yeah, like a sort of wingsuit I can kind of deploy. <laughs> yeah. yeah, we'll have like Dob on a Like a Fulton extraction hook that just... Yeah, yeah yes, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> just, yeah. And Vocatus needs... <laughs> Vocatus yeah. needs to believe that he's talking to Liliana. Yeah, so one of us needs to be in disguise as Liliana and go to the dinner with... Uh, Vacatus. Mm-hmm. 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 Yeah. Oh, so maybe, maybe Prudence would like... be perfect because then when he tries to steal your magic, it's already gone. He won't be able <gasps> yes! to do it. He can't double steal my magic. So yeah. I can. Yes. Uh, yeah, I can cast disguise self on Prudence. I yeah, make, uh, make me Liliana. Liliana. This is a perfect plan. This oh, wait, is the best yes. plan we've ever had. And, and wait, and wait. The only that's the, the problem only... with disguise self is yeah. as a spell. Uh, right? is... I, I have a disguise kit. It, yeah. I have a disguise yeah. kit. We can do it. We can. Dog can disguise me. Yeah. The only, uh, the the only very very small hole in this plan is what is the outcome we are trying to achieve. <laughs> That's two the dinners. only bit I'm not clear on. I know two dinners, but like to <laughs> what to, re- <laughs> to reunite with our divorced wife, <laughs> so we can see the kids and continue our career as a children's TV host. Yeah. Okay. 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 I don't know if this okay. is any simpler than just trying to get someone to cast message to Liliana and saying, do not trust Vacatus. Vacatus and watching and seeing what happens. But two separate illusory dinners, Merylwen. <laughs> I mean, if I the ship's know. within 120 feet. Wait, no, I can't cast message. Oh, I damn it. Oh, damn it. We won't be able to do <laughs> yeah, Merylwen's oh, insensible oh, yeah. idea. Can. No, Dog I can. doubt spell Dog slots are all, spell slots all gone, I think. Yeah, yeah. spell slots oh, all used no. up, so it's the illusory dinners. <laughs> like we've been discussing this for about an hour and a half. Yeah, the it's <laughs> got the door now. Right, now. Do we turn around and Liliana is just I watching? The ship, is, the ship is quite close now. Okay, okay. We're out of time, people. Okay. Just eyeing the windows like <laughs> Okay. Okay. Right. All right. What are the What are the goals of each dinner? We need to We need to determine what's going on with this plan. What Vacatus's plan is, if he wants to team up, if he wants to steal Liliana's magic, and yeah. also we want to get Liliana out of here because she's bad news. Oh well, maybe um, maybe Prudence as Liliana yes. uh, can uh, sort of uh, make Vacatus think that she's kind of into the plan, and, and yes. or, or or if we know he's, he wants to steal the magic, perhaps yes. she could be like, oh no. Uh, like uh, let let us go and discuss this a hundred miles away, or or you know like lure him away, deny him the magic stealing. We've got to keep the them time. apart, obviously, so that yeah. Vocatus doesn't get Liliana's magic. Keep them okay. apart feels yeah. like a great keep goal. Them apart. Meanwhile, uh, I in the Liliana dinner just keep her talking until dinner one with Liliana Prudence and <laughs> real Vocatus. Dinner one, yes. Dinner one until that has played out, and you have removed Liliana. Uh, no, Vocatus would, from the situation. Okay, would it not yes. make more sense? cross-eyed. Dob, <laughs> isn't she just going to want to kill you because of Ox Ventures? Wouldn't it be... No. Wouldn't it be more sensible if you were disguised as Vocatus? Yes, that, yeah, that, yeah, that's also a great plan. Okay, Let's do that. okay, yeah. okay. Okay, and so, so the, so, the, two, so the, the dinner will be is... playing out as, as it would do. Yeah. But uh-huh, uh-huh. One half of the equation on each side is played by one of us in disguise. Yes, Perfect. and the, the goal symmetry, the goal it. is to like draw to draw the two powerful magic users Away far apart from each, from each other, and then Thereby, bam, trap dungeon. <laughs> yeah, and then I, I don't know what the plan is after that, but I guess we can we can we'll figure it out. <laughs> What I love about it is the, is the simplicity of the plan. <laughs> <laughs> Two illusory this... dinners. So elegant. This is the most complicated it's ever gotten. All right. We'll need the house to create a perfect um, false dimension, pocket dimension. Has anyone talked to the house yet? Is it I mean, do we really need the house to be involved even? It's just two dinners. Yeah, we could yeah, just, we set could up just two lock dinners. one door. We could just yeah. narrow, be like, Liliana, go this way. <laughs> <laughs> For cases, go this way. There are, several, there are several entrances to the house. We can just okay, cool. funnel them through All different right. ways. All right, Job, I need you to do me up as Liliana. All right. Uh, I break out my disguise kit and, okay. um, uh, I mean, having studied and thought about Liliana's features... Uh, a, a healthy amount, I um, am able to perfectly recreate this disguise wise. Yes, this does Ooh. not escape the notice of a certain someone <laughs> who actually says, Oh, so that's what she looks like. Uh, I mean, like a bit. This. A bit. I can't really remember. I think I don't know if I got the nose right. No, I did get the nose right. <laughs> <laughs> Look at these long eyelashes. Uh... 
<laughs> Dub will. I, I move the eyes just a bit too far apart. <laughs> 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 okay, Dob, are we making you up like um, like Vicatus? Yeah, Vicatus, chicken my legs. Right. Chicken my legs right now, Corey. Okay. I break Dob's knees. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, now I'm going to put some, uh, just some, get some makeup going. Um, yeah, maybe... he's quite handsome up top and then sort of rooster down below. Yeah. Uh... When you say down below. <laughs> <laughs> Dog, yeah. maybe you could major illusion your legs. I'm not sure if they're gonna. Uh, yeah, I could. Um, well, it will require it will require concentration. Oh, okay. So, but as long as I don't have to do Just... anything else at the same time, my legs should remain perfectly <laughs> chicken. Well, as long as you're, well, as long no. as you can maintain your legs, will be under ta- your legs yes, will be able to sit at the table. You'll be fine. It's, exactly. It's as long flawless. as I stay sat down, it'll be fine. All right. So let's just get the vacator's <laughs> face and Bobby makeup yeah. on. What does he look like again? Just like he looks not. Just yeah, a, like sort of puckish. puckish. So yeah, cool. Yeah. Mm. All right. Um, cool. Do we want to set up any of the traps? It can't hurt to have like a couple of chandelier traps. Well, yeah. we'll need, um, we need my Fulton extraction, and we also need like an escape plan for prudence, and probably okay. it wouldn't. I, what I, I would terrib- like to rig up for Dob is a hook that goes into his belt loop. Yeah. And then mm. when a switch is pulled, <laughs> <Tears his stomach laughs> it, it yanks granting him, him a quick death. It yanks him backwards and up the chimney onto the roof. <laughs> yeah. Okay. It's a kind of, it's this complicated system of police. Uh-huh. Uh, no, stranger things have happened. <laughs> yeah. I'd like to put like a trap door under each of the chairs that our enemies will be sitting on top of. Sure. Uh, Necropolis on Sea uh, can also offer um, a sword that will drop from the ceiling onto uh, anyone's chair if they happen to sit in the wrong place. Yeah. Very nice. Mm-hmm. Very nice. Sword of Coracles. <laughs> uh, Prudence, do you want any any backup assurances? I tell you, I'm gonna think... I'm gonna go into the room where Prudence is, and I'm gonna do my painting. I'm painted into the. Okay, painting. cool. I don't think Vicatus is gonna hurt me because I don't really no. I don't pose any threat. If he unmasks me, I'm just a magicless warlock. What I'm good am for, I? Here for so... backup if needed. Okay, yeah. so who's painting Corazon into the picture? Mm. I'll, I'll do it. I'll, okay. no, I'll do it because you have to concentrate on your illusion. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, good point. And everything I paint in this house is a tasteful nude, so it probably needs to do it. <laughs> there is that. Uh, could you just make me a deck sleight of hand check, please, Merylwen? Okay. Um, this is going to happen either way. It's, it's just more to, it's just sort of to give us the sense of okay. what we're getting here. What kind of painting? Just how nude. How okay, nude. that is a 10. Oh, half okay. naked. Yeah. Um, <laughs> half, half nude. <laughs> just half. the left half. <laughs> oh. No, it's oh, it's dear. there's it's more of a cumulative thing. Like you know, like Corazon. There's a lot of chest going on. Sort of, um, you know, uh, there's a rakish cut to the shorts of this painting. But generally speaking, yes, it is the painting. What sort of pose are you adopting, and what sort of figure are you adopting here, Corazon? Well, I'm holding two cutlasses in a kind of like. Of course, yes. Like I'm advancing on an enemy. But I'm yep. Side on profile. Nudely. Okay. Oh, and of course, this is this is your house. It could just be a portrait of you. Yeah, exactly. Is that yeah. what you were? Yeah. Is what it you were going be, for the whole time? Yeah, yeah. It would be a large painting of me over the fireplace, but over where the paint. I think there yeah. is a large painting of me over the fireplace. I'm basically adopting the exact pose over it, and I've been covered in paint to make it look like I am. It's yeah. Like a three just to painting. have lines on. Yeah. 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 Okay. Mm. Great. Any other things? You're rigging up gargoyles to drop on the the front what, porch. Meryl, when and Egbert, what will you be doing during the? Bomb in the blamange. Blomp, bomb, blamange. Okay, so Corazon's looking over Prudence. I'm gonna watch over Dob. Okay. Nice. So we paint. Um, I'm like in, into in a the painting. rafters. Oh, you're in the rafters. No, I'm in. You're I'm in, in the, the rafters. rafters. Just like. Um, also, uh, I gesture to a uh, a, a tall, um, ornate fishbowl on a tall stand, uh, and say, Katie, maybe you want to join us on this. Uh, Disguise. I'm sure, we could use some backup if it all goes south. She's gonna pretend to be a fishbowl. She could pretend to be a lamp. <laughs> or, pretend. I mean, um, what about the 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 full, how is the full the Fulton extraction thing? Maybe we need someone on the on the lever. It's okay. On the roof. That's yeah. what I've given. Yeah, that on to, the roof. I've given that to Meryl when she can press it. To, I don't really want to see any of this stuff, so I'm just gonna go help. Uh, stick a bomb in a blamange, probably. Yeah, that's fair. That's fair. Okay. That's yes. fair and cool. Yeah, I'll, I'll go help. I'll go help this Extraction system, if it needs to be pressed. Okay. So, all right. Here's Don't the hack button. it up, she says, and she leaves the room. Mm. 
Meryl went, don't press that by accident. No, I won't. Don't There's worry. like a 50% chance it'll just tear his spine. <laughs> 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 Not the seat of the soul. Uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. It feels like Which we have... would surprise Liliana. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think anything would surprise Liliana more. <laughs> um, the house seems to be rigged up. If we, do we need someone to like be a butler um, to sort of show each person to Biz- their respective... Bismuth! Bismuth! Bismuth. Bismuth. Yeah. Bismuth. Yeah. 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 We, brief, oh, we brief Bismuth on the details of the plan, which are so simple and clear to me that I don't think we even need <laughs> to repeat It takes like them. one second. <laughs> I'm supposed to be running things to and from the kitchen. Oh, I mean, it's fine. It's like, ugh. You can introduce our guests to their respective dining rooms. Though. Oh, but who's going to stir the soup? Oh, I'll how stir about the this? soup. Egbert's going to stir the soup and, you know, maybe eat something. Yeah, Egbert can yeah. help in the kitchen. Yes. Egg, Egg, oh. Egbert, could, Egbert, could be, um, Egbert could be a sort of waiter and server, at least definitely in the uh, Liliana and uh, where the one where I'm for Gatus. Dinner too. Why? Because Why? How? She's cloned him before. I know, yeah, but I could probably be. knows who he is. Yeah. I know, but I exactly. But I could really impress Liliana, make a great first impression, being like, "Look what a powerful mage I am." Also, I have this hated enemy of yours Hypnotized. in my thrall. Want to know ah. more? Just hear, hear the rest of my dinner. Okay. Or we could just throw a sheet over him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a spooky house. Here I is mean, a goat. You- this ghost butler will bring you your blamange. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> don't mind the hissing noise it's making. I like the plan where Egbert has to pretend to be in, in Dob's right. thrall. I evoke okay. Otis's thrall. Okay. Yeah. All right. And uh, what should I do with the marauding party coming up the, the beach with all of the, uh, the the maces and the burning torches? Now? Tell them they're not allowed in. Yeah, they can wait outside. They have to oh, wait on yeah. the lawn. Okay, but well, they look like they're coming to kill some people. She well, starts wait. to sort of hobble her way to the front door like... <laughs> And she opens the front door, and sure enough, you can see that the inevitability has docked. Uh oh. Uh, Necropolis on sea. Uh oh. And that Liliana is kind of walking toward the house. And in front of her is like a small army of pretty much perfect Egbert clones. <gasps> they're not oh, dressed no. in paladin armor, they're dressed in sort of more like stylized bad guy armor, but mm. yeah, she's. she's Come prepared, assuming that she's going to find the Oxventurers and kill them all. Places, Ooh. everyone, I say. And okay. okay. We don't have uh, nearly enough dinner for this many Egberts. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>